but they're all pretty new. Nice shape. Uh, 50 bucks on that. No way to do 75 for all of it. Oh, there you go. I guess you gotta keep some stuff. Yeah. Speed whackers. Engines. Lights over here. That's a cool cash register. I think it's old. Let's take a look out here. How are you? Is that really interesting? Yeah, there's you on your shoes. <laughs> I'd probably get hurt yeah. at that point. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, we'll go around this way. Yeah, I don't need that one. What's the other one over there? Jack Wilson. Yeah, I don't need those ones. There's a bunch of buttons. I don't think I need that one. Well, I got a guy coming up to the turkey at the time, so I gotta get rolling. Oh, you got spring bother? Oh, oh man, that beard was dragging the ground. <laughs> I'm telling you. Yeah. I got turkeys everywhere. People get shot up at turkey. I've shot two of them. On this. Curious. Who are you asking on this one? Could do that. It's neat. Looks like it'll be challenging. Okay, yeah, we'll do that. How about you? What are you asking on the trains? I mean, well, I'd like to get like a little bit of money for that Santa Fe, like maybe 150, but the rest of the stuff, I mean, like, I think those cabooses are cheap, class, like once five bucks. Okay. Some of the other stuff, 10, 15 bucks, like, you know. Okay. Well, John, I got a roll, buddy. Right, Very nice you. to meet you. Yep. Like I said, you get all done. If you, if you need help, I got a trailer. We can take a couple pounds of crap. You know, need, uh, Here, hold this for a second. I need to get rid of it. I can get rid of it. Yeah. 
I usually get a couple of gallon at a time, yeah. and when I have a big wash fire, yeah, yeah, lose it on there. Yeah, yeah. We can work something out. All right. All right, you got my number. Thanks, okay. John. You take care. Yep. I'll see you, Tom. Take care, my <laughs> man. How about five bucks for one of these? Let me uh, do some uh, research. Choice? Choice. What? Uh, I know. It's been open. Control book for, for trains. That's it, it's definitely gas. Yeah. Yeah. one of the best jobs in the valley. Yeah, well, especially the retirement. Yeah. Oh, especially your wife gets hacked. Yeah, right, yeah. That's a crazy I'm not, setup. I'm not in any hurry to get married again, but... <laughs> <laughs> but man, that's... Uh, you know Keith Busey? Yeah. yeah. He was just telling me the other day his wife's getting an extra half when he bought a place in uh, Florida. He goes, just her half is paying for the place in Florida. Yeah, that more money than that. Yeah. I, I knew, you know, well, he lived right did, there. Yeah. Keith, Wayne. Yep. Leroy. Leroy and I were. I didn't know Leroy. Well, he was my. Yeah, Wayne and Wayne and Wayne got paid on my kid and stuff. And he's my godfather. Oh, really? Yeah, yeah. Yep, he, you see, he worked a short line in Mexico, too, I think, a while ago. Well, he was out in Jersey for a long time. When the real, what, yeah, when the, like in the, the 70s 80s, and the early 80s, yeah. when everything was gone. When he went to Jersey, he would, he would come home on the weekends, but he stayed in Jersey. Yeah, with like week. seven guys at a Has been busy today. Been busy. All right, I'll see you tomorrow. Been nine busy this morning. Yeah, as soon as nine o'clock, everybody was. Everybody nine o'clock tomorrow. Yeah, Sunday yeah. too. Yeah. <clears throat> and we went to two other sales across the river, and they were advertised as multifamily. It was one. Yeah. It was like. New York sailor. Tried to, in this, yeah. tr tried to. Never know what you're gonna find cool. No, a lot of people, they, that's like a hobby, you know? Yeah, I mean, it's, it's nice now that the yard sales are starting up, and I've always driven past here, and it's like, what is, like, what is, never knew what was in here. Yeah, yeah, I've been trying to sort through. This place was just absolutely full of Oh, really? Yeah. Or are you planning on turning it into, or? Yeah, I'm trying, gonna, uh, in the next year, try to get a tire shop started. Just That'd be nice. Tires, you know, not, hey. Well, that'll work. Hey guys, if you made it this far already, please hit that thumbs up down below and also leave a comment. It helps out the channel so much when you guys comment and hit that thumbs up. Now back to the footage. Yeah, I'm gonna try to bring it back. My grandfather started this in 1948. Oh, really? Yeah, right after World War II. What are you asking on the jackets? I mean, I guess it depends on what it is. Harley one. What this one is. Parrot. Never heard of that one. No, I know there was a marble one somewhere. U.S. Army. <clears throat> so all this stuff was just left in here? Well, no, a lot of it came from my dad's house. Okay. 
trying to consolidate it for this yard sale. I've been working on it for like a year. I'm trying to get everything consolidated. Yeah, I probably, I mean, probably the, probably the Harley jacket would be interesting in that one. Interesting. Just because it's a Harley 125. 20, 30. What do we, what do you ask on this one? Well, 25 for that stuff. Okay. 25 Do 50. That. And then what about those, th there's those three line L ones in this box. This set here? Yeah. I think it's missing one card. It looks, like it looks like there's an empty spot there. there. Probably was a transformer that came with it. Okay. But uh, it's missing one card. Um, but they're all pretty new. Nice shape. Uh, 50 bucks on that. No way to do 75 for all of it? Yeah, yeah, I'll do 75. Okay. And I'll stop back down tomorrow too. Maybe might come back down for some of this. I mean, if you, look, I mean, if you look around, I know that there's no boxes, so they're not worth a whole lot. But no, oh, no, but like, that's a cool train right yeah, there. That, that pirate one's, yeah. there's 80 here. I think even this one's a Steeler one. Probably, oh, really? I think there was probably a bus on here for, like, Bettis, oh. you know, but uh, it's missing. Yeah. Hey, guys, welcome back. Wow, that was a, a super, super, super unexpected stop. Uh, it was on our way home. We hit a couple sales during the morning. Then I remembered right down by our street... We had a sale going on at this gas station, an old gas station. And I thought, you know what, let's go check it out and let's see how it is. Well, I'm really glad we stopped. I know you guys have already seen the footage and you've probably seen what we've already grabbed, but I'm gonna show you up close and show you some comps on some of these items. So one of the first things we found was this vi visible V8 engine. Uh, Ravel makes it, it is brand new sealed. It has one little hole right here on the plastic, but this thing is amazing. It is a skill level five. Uh, it is honestly really, really cool. It even has a hand crank uh, to operate the pistons and the valves. It is super, super cool. I'm going to put a soul comp up here on the screen. I was blown away. I know that these models, some of these models do really well, but I was not, I was shocked how good this one does. So I asked him how much, and he said $10. Well, I'm gonna take that because the return on investment on this is going to be great. So I set that off to the side and kept on looking. And one of the next items I found, which now I don't see it out here because we just moved stuff around the garage. What was this set right here? You have a pair of pliers that's a knife, a spoon that's a wrench, and then like a socket fork. These are really nice, they're kind of really heavy duty. Wrenchware.com. I did not call these, but we threw these in the pile, and I'll tell you in a second how much we spent on that pile alone. One of the next toys we found was this. I was honestly not going to look this thing up, but it is called Workman. Uh, it's really, I, look, to me it looked a little bit cheap, but it does work. Uh, my kid actually got it to make noises, but now I can't. Go figure. Oh, there. This thing actually moves. It makes some noises. It does light up. It's really, it's a really cool, cool piece uh dipstick pistons screwdrivers everything i mean you can put the oil filter engine can be taken apart and put back together really really cool item and yeah so i threw that in the pile also i have another item hanging up over here i'm going to show you real quick and then i'll tell you how much i spent for this group but then the last item i think is going to be where the money's going to be made this item right here we picked up this harley davidson jacket size large uh nothing on the front Really, really good shape. It's a nice jacket. It does have some wear up around the collar, but on the back is where it's at. The back has this nice Harley Davidson logo. Really, really awesome jacket. Now I was kind of bummed. Uh, I didn't comp it there too much, just because it is Harley. And I know Harley does really well. The jacket probably sells for about 40 to 50 bucks. So it's not a huge thing. So with the jacket, silverware, and these two engine things here, he wanted $50 total, which was great because the next item I'm gonna show you really makes up for all this. So I know you guys can tell in the footage there was a bunch of Lionel trains there and stuff, and a lot of this stuff was dirty, broken, just nothing not new with box or it, with the boxes, but the thing I found here was with the box and pretty much new. So I've seen this box sitting there, and I go to open it up, and there's this Lionel train this has the train engine with the coal car. This has the rolling stock car, another rolling stock car, and another rolling stock car. Now, 
It is missing one train, and it's also missing the power adapter. So looking these up online, a set of these goes for about 130 bucks. I'm gonna throw a comp up on the screen. Well, this is a complete set. Now, remember, I've said this in previous videos, sometimes if you part it out, you can make more money. I think in this case, I might be better off selling these individually, because somebody might just be looking for that one train, and they can get it reasonably. So. I asked him how much on this. He said 50. I said, how about 25? And let's make it an even $75 for everything. And he accepted. I was kind of shocked that he did accept, but I threw it out there. It's like, hey, I got to do some cleaning up on this box. Uh, it's going to take a little bit, I think, for a couple of these things to sell, but I think the money's there to be made. So I'm super happy. He's actually going to have the sale the following day. Also, maybe I'll go back down and see if I can grab something else on the last day if he wants to get rid of this stuff. Hopefully you guys enjoyed that video. Remember guys, smash that thumbs up, leave us a comment, and hit that subscribe button down below. And a bell notification too so that you're notified when we post new videos. So until next time guys, remember stay safe, stay healthy, and keep picking guys. Bye.